Hey there guys, before I start this vlog, I'm just gonna let you know this is a comprehensive review of the TARDIS, my current apartment, and here we go. Let's do this. So this is the TARDIS. I'm upgrading this TARDIS detail to eventually have a full size TARDIS with custom police box logo windows, uh, police box logo inside, and windows that's going inside. Come on in. Hey guys, so this is the TARDIS walkthrough of the hallway. You can come on in. I'll give you a more comprehensive review of this. So just so you know, this this tard these guitars here will be moving to the bedroom and there'll be a lock shelf here and hopefully a lock shelf here and they'll be able to kind of keep some more figurines on there maybe some fungo pops something new this is also my current area i want to see if i can get a plug in here so i can put some lights or maybe some other stuff like that um if you want to get close-ups of these you can go ahead uh get a close-up of all the uh the shots here um, these are all unboxed and you'll see them in another part of the TARDIS uh, yeah and then the books behind here these three books here are books I grew up reading when I was a child they're all my loving TARDIS books um, this is actually signed by Adam West right here and Burt Ward right here and then these are all I was wanting to get this Joker comic signed by uh, Mark Hamill and Kevin Conroy, but didn't because I lost the ticket to get Kevin Conroy and Mark Hamill's signatures. Um, and then this is just a sign I plan to change. I don't know if I'm going to change it yet. This door leads to the TARDIS. We'll talk about that later. Um, let's go in the bathroom and talk a bit about this room. So, welcome to my bathroom. Uh, it's nothing very fancy right now, but I am looking at possibly putting a shelving around the toilet here uh, and putting some fungal pops or maybe some figurines in here. This shelf here, I am planning to upgrade and move the the de the um the um the rod here over behind the door. Um, if you want to get a more close up of the there, the this. Uh, speaker here I'm actually removing when I get my 13.2 channel restaurant sound which we'll talk about later uh, this is actually pretty cool this is my well my big on the inside bath shower curtains I guess um, this here is my wolves and then the OG uh, shower curtain and then we have my my personal uh, towel um, let's see let's go into the chambers and see how that's going uh, so as you can see okay there guys this is my LARPing sword I haven't been LARPing but would like to try it I did buy it at Fan Expo hope you are interested in LARPing if you are leave a comment down below um, took this photo I did spend 40 bucks on these photos for sick kids hospital booth um, this is a drawing done by my best friend Andrew Kane, aka Blake Belladonna. Uh, and then this is my current, well, last year's, or sorry, two years ago, uh, Van Exo book. And let's go into the TARDIS and see. Let's go into the chambers uh, and see where we're at. Uh, these are all my Van Exo books. Um, you can get close ups of them and kind of get a good look at them. Uh, 
then if you kind of come around this way, I'll show you what's behind the door. Uh, these are kind of, this was made by a friend years ago. Uh, it's an Alpha and Omega. I was really into walls when I was younger. Um, this is Ruby. I didn't think I'd get this signed, but I might when I go to RTX sometime soon. Uh, this is my wardrobe. It's currently a mess. That's why the door doesn't close. Uh, and then there's some other photos over there that are like if you want to get a close up of those. Um, but, and we'll just get a good hand shot of me standing in the middle of my target, my chambers. So, this is my chambers. This is everything where I sleep, where I play piano, I can watch television. Uh, let's go and work around this way of the room. So this sound system that, oh, I just hit my, my keyboard. Uh, this sound system you see here is actually going to be transferred out for the den in that's in the other room. And again, we'll talk about that later. This TV here, shout out to Caroline for the photo. Um, this TV here will actually be moved into the living room eventually because I'm doing a new setup in there. Again, we'll talk about that later. These are all my Doctor Who stuff. Um, yeah, the, these are my Time War journals and previous timeline journals. Uh, these are Doctor Who collectibles through the years. Um, yeah. And then these are all my family photos from my foster foster family to my blood to my dad to my grandparents to nexus um hope you oh and then this is the extended family too hope you enjoy it um yeah and then these are my twilight collection uh from my different books from french to english to hardback and the cool thing is i do have a custom signature book right here i can show you the signature this is the signature book by Stephanie Meyer. I didn't meet her, but I had this pre-signed. There's Stephanie Meyer's signature. Um, and I really miss this one shop. It's called, it, it was called It's Perfect, which I truly loved and cared, cared for, um, was this, this lunchbox I got from It's Perfect, loved it. Loved going there, the people were very nice. Um, it's currently closed now because they retired uh, and then this this is my favorite um, you will be figuring for fungal pops right now I have a fungal pop for TARDIS because I found that at Walmart for I think $22 um, these are my Ruby mint condition Ruby figurines and then these are also mint and unboxed they're not they're still in their character boxes. Um, these are all different photos I collected through the years. Uh, yeah. And then we have... Yeah, these, and this actually was the last photo taken from before I went off to live in group homes. And then these are all my different... Uh, different Rory volumes. Volumes 1 through 6. And then this is an unbox. You saw this. Uh, you saw this Batman out in the hallway. And then we have my baby, the black cat, right there. He is right there. Unfortunately, he passed away about I think three years ago. Um, now, if we go back over this way. Uh, oh, and this is also going to be upgraded. I eventually want to upgrade this to have a fireplace in it. Um, these are all different photos and of family and custom photos. Don't mind that, that's my neighbors. Um, sorry about that. Uh, these are all photos from my past here, if you wanna get a close up of them. Uh, these are all different photos from my past. And again, don't, um, Then this is my bed here. This is where I sleep mostly. I do sleep in another spot in the TARDIS that we'll talk about later. Um, this is my bed. Um, these are all my jackets that I do wear regularly. One of them I currently 
of damage that I did. Although the arm pit ripped out of one of them. Uh, and then this is my piano here. I do play with the coronavirus or COVID-19 crisis. I plan to learn how to play piano. Um, oh, this is actually a pretty cool um, little spot. This is my grandma's uh, chair. My grandpa gave it to me when I first moved in here and it's been sitting in the TARDIS ever since. I do sit here sometimes to read and just think. This here is actually going to get moved. I'm going to get rid of this and put a large lag shelf along the top. Two little lag shelves along the upper part and then a new dresser to kind of give a more modern look to the TARDIS. So if you follow me again, we'll... Uh... So now you're about to see the piece of resistance, the TARDIS. Welcome to my home. This is the TARDIS where I currently watch TV, chill, write, play video games, and all that other stuff. Um, these are my precious Matt, Matt Smith and Capaldi photos. Um, now to talk a bit more about the TARDIS door, I am having this door custom built to be able to split like the TARDIS to do the TARDIS door feel. Um, I plan to eventually get custom decals and maybe have a custom door built so that it gives that whole tardis -y door feel. Um, yeah, so uh, just have a gander around and kind of enjoy. These are my ruby figurines. I take, I take great care of them and I have custom built the backs and top bottoms of them to be able to go and give light and give more character to them. Uh, the lightsabers, I deal, I do do, I do duel with this one here. This one's my favorite. I love dueling with that one. Oh, and shout out to Ashley. I don't recall her last name, but she gave me this painting of a dragon. I call it the water dragon for ten dollars. Um, uh, so this is actually signed by Vic, who doesn't do Full Metal Alchemist anymore kind of miss that he doesn't um and yeah just kind of take a gander and then i'll talk to you more about the upgrades that i plan to do like that painting there you're currently looking at is a custom painting by spray paint it's not painted like a usual watercolors or whatever it's actually spray painted and it's really quite enjoyable i got it for a gift or from a gift from my buddy sean who gave me that for a fan expo gift and then the final spot you're going to see, this open spot here, we'll talk about that in a moment. It's next to these the, the Capaldi magazines you saw. And I plan to show you a bit more upgrades to that later on in the video. This is my Lazy Boy. Only two people in the world are allowed to sit in it, my, own, my family included. Uh, but I have two people I care about that are only allowed to sit in this. Uh, this painting here I'm actually redoing soon to be able to give it a bit more color, a bit more depth, more life, even though I am colorblind. Um, this is my makeshift wall. I don't actually know what to call it yet. I'm kind of just throwing things together on this wall. Um, this desk here I am actually getting rid of. And then I'm putting a whole L-shaped desk in here, putting my gaming PC, which is down here. I plan to build this gaming PC eventually. I plan to build this gaming PC eventually and have it, uh, have it eventually be able to go and have the monitor that you saw in the bedroom, which will be coming back in here, mounted to this wall here, and then be able to go and do um, my gaming PC and my other computer that you saw in the bedroom. Uh, I am putting a Apple computer here. I plan to buy that as well, brand new. There will be a comprehensive review for both of those. Um, this desk I actually don't need anymore because it doesn't suit or fit my needs because I want to journal and be able to do computery stuff. Like if you actually back up to the door, I can show you uh, what I mean by this whole setup here. Um, this whole setup here, like from the couch to here and along here, I'm actually making it into a pod 
podcast studio where there will be like there'll be a, a mic here a mic here a mic here and then one by my lazy boy that will be able to go and do a podcast where i'll have sunflower stables come in or as it's now known as sunflower farms hashtag sunflower farms um this tv here if you kind of come in here and get a good shot of it this is blake or Andrew King, shout out to her for giving me this photo at my anniversary. Um, this TV will be going in the bedroom and then there'll be a 75 inch 8K TV again, ex expected conference and review. The reason that this fireplace is here is because this one got damaged when they were putting in my dishwasher, which you'll see later on in the vlog. This, this fireplace will be upgraded and fixed possibly soon. Um, Denon system down here is running beautifully, but I want to upgrade it and have a 7 point, no sorry, 13.2 channel surround sound and all the speakers you hear playing the TARDIS sound will be upgraded to be able to go and play Dolby Atmos music. Um, this is my TARDIS here, you can get a close up. I do have Matt Smith's Sonic here that he held in the photo my favorite sonic um, this is licensed by Gallifrey and this TARDIS I custom built by myself with bits and pieces of different stuff like we have uh, the e-brake the doors does lock the doors time unlock secure lock shields rough stabilizers and then the time materializer and the past coordinates present and future over there and then we'll just kind of reverse these back to the original setting so that we can eventually leave this spot actually let's let's talk about over here this is actually a really cool spot this is my signatures by rooster teeth i met them each in person and i loved that they took time to meet me and sign my signature and stuff like we have barbara Dondoma, we have vic we have ellie we have chris with some other people i forget like you'll see in the photos um, they were kind enough to meet me at Fan Expo, and I am gracious they did. Uh, this is also my Doctor Who Tower, um, when you're done there. This is Doctor Who Tower. Now, the Sonic here, this, this is all, all my signatures and collectibles that are precious to me. Capaldi actually wore those sunglasses there, and this, this, uh, held the Sonic. Matt Smith actually held this Sonic like I told you. He held this Sonic here and I am currently using that as my Sonic when I want to fool around and play Doctor Who. Um, this picture here, like I said earlier, is going to go over to the new canvas area by where you saw. And then we have Jessica Negri. We have a Jessica Negri signature in photos. Um, Khaleesi, because I was really into Khaleesi when I got this photo. Uh, we also have a shipped in Orlando Studios wand. It's Dumbledore's second one. I'm actually going to make sure I put it in the right the way I like it. Um, the way I mounted this, I just basically took some nails, took the back of it, and nailed it to the wall. So it makes it look like it's a Harry Potter floating wand. This is Stanley's signature and Matt Smith's signature. I met them, t I met Matt Smith and Stanley twice. Um, this is my kitchen. Now, I do plan to put a Google Home Hub here, and then when the TV rotates out, get a Google Chromecast Ultra. This is the dishwasher that wrecked my, uh, well, my bigger fireplace. And this is a Goku figurine, thanks to Sean Mayer, who shout out, Sean Mayer gave me that photo. And then this I got for Christmas. It does actually make sounds. Um, nothing new is going to go really in here, aside from the fact that I'm redoing the walls of the kitchen with uh, tile, and the bathroom will also be redone with tile, I forgot to mention that. Um, these are my two Dr. Expo pre-Dr. Expo photos, where it's like Dr. Expo and then regenerating out to Dr. Expo. Um, my fridge, some Hacksmith photos, my shoehorn or shoe um so now that's pretty much the TARDIS uh 
Hope you enjoyed yourselves. I'll, I'll see you in the next vlog. Hopefully tomorrow I'm going to talk about coronavirus and maybe talk about the difference with the YouTube channel. I'll see you around. Dr. Expo, out. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss a video. See you on Dr. Expo out.